Hey, what's up guys? I'm not here at Monster Gadgets. I hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you might be. Today is Tuesday, April 2nd, 2019. And today we are going to be talking about AirPods. And yes, they are the new ones. They call them the new... Oh, hold on. I'm getting a call here. Hello? Oh, hi, Tim. How are you? I'm, I'm actually just talking about the AirPods right now. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, Tim, I'm, I'm actually in the middle of a video. I'm, I'm doing my uh, my Tuesday video for my YouTube channel. Oh, that's great. I'm, I'm glad you've seen all of them. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate it. But since, Tim, since, since I've got you on the phone, um, uh, let me ask you, What's the main difference between the new AirPods and the old AirPods and why didn't you call the new ones uh, AirPods 2 which pretty much everyone's going to call instead of calling them just AirPods? Mm. Mm. Oh, you, you lost creativity. That That's why I see. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. so, so what's the major difference between the two, Tim? Oh, just better battery life. No, no sound quality difference? Why? Oh, they were already good enough before so you couldn't make them any better. I see. Okay. So Tim, what about the design? How come the design's not no different? They look identical to the old ones. Oh, again, creativity. You just, you can't create any more things, huh? Yeah, so you made it look exactly the same. So, uh, you know, the guy next to me could be wearing them, anyone could be wearing them, and you can't really tell if they're wearing the new ones or the old ones, and people like, people kind of like, you know, to differentiate, uh, themselves from others and kind of show they've, they've got the latest and greatest maybe. Oh, you thought about that? Okay. Mm -hmm. But you still came out with the same design. I understand. Okay. All right, Tim, I'm going to go and let you go because I got to continue my video. But uh, thanks for hitting me up and uh, I'll talk to you soon, Tim. All right, bye. Oh, you got something something else? All right, well, let me go ahead and send them to intro and uh, I'll, I'll, I'll talk to you for a second. All right. Oh, no, yeah, no, Tim, I'm talking to them. I'm going to send them to intro. All right, hold on, okay? All right. All right, I'll talk to you guys after the intro. Tim, yes, I'm still here. All right, guys, welcome back. I apologize. Tim didn't know I was going to be doing a video for you guys, and he just decided to call, so... No, I'm joking. That wasn't really Tim. But anyways, I hope you guys got that. Um, anyway, so we're talking about the AirPods too. As you guys know, um, these are pretty much, they look identical to the AirPods, original AirPods. There's really no big difference between the two outside of really just the battery life improving a little bit. There really isn't any uh, improvement in sound quality or anything like that. I'm not sure why they didn't make more improvements to this than the previous version, but they are here. Um, I've had these for about a week now and I've tested them in the gym, I've tested them while driving, I've tested them just in pretty much every environment you can think of and quite honestly they operate the same exact way as the, the previous version. So really no update if you've had the, the first version. I personally don't feel there's a need to upgrade and uh, buy the new ones but on uh, the new ones like I said the, the battery life is a little bit better on these as compared to the older ones. So there's three variants you can buy. You can buy it with the wireless case, charging case that it has in it, on it now. Um, this goes for $199 with the wireless case. Uh, $159, I believe it is, without the actual wireless case, just normal um, old case. And then you can buy the case separately for $79.99 if you wanted to. So if you have the version one and you wanna buy the wireless charging case itself, it's 80 bucks for that. So that's really about it. Uh, one thing that I do wanna also update you guys on is um, when these came out about a week ago or so, as you can see on the packaging itself, a lot of people have been waiting for this was the air power charging mat, which Apple announced a couple of years ago that they were going to release it. And the funny thing is it still says on here that it's compatible with the uh, air power mat. And just a couple of days ago, Apple came out and basically officially announced that the mat, it's no longer going to be. Uh, a product anymore. So even though they released it or announced it, I should say a couple of years ago, and they've been pushing it, pushing it, pushing it, saying they're working on it, they're working on it. Um, they finally came out and said that project is dead. So that project is no longer going to happen and they're no longer going to make the charging 
mat itself. Um, I, from what I've seen in the resources online, it looks like they're having issues with actual coils that charge wirelessly. And what they were trying to do was they were trying to create a one mat, which you can put all your devices on and charge them wirelessly. Um, but I guess the coils are overheating and they're unable to do that. So that project is scrapped. So don't, I guess now you can give up your hopes. We've all been waiting for it, but now we know for sure they're no longer gonna make it. I guess they could have done a better job instead of putting it in the box that is compatible with that. And then two days, three days later coming out and saying the project is dead. Um, they could have probably announced it together and not put it on the new product they just released. But anyways, that's the latest from Apple regarding the AirPods. So uh, one other thing that I do wanna cover, I have had issues with these thing in my ears. And I know a lot of people out there also have issues with these thing in the ear. So I did purchase uh, these silicone covers that you can buy off Amazon. I'll go ahead and link it in my description so you guys can go check it out. These actually work really, really well. So what they look like is, let me focus there, silicone shells that go onto the unit itself. And this part of course goes into the ear. So it stays in your ear a little bit better. So if you even have version one, you can still pick these up to make them stay better in your ear, especially if you're gonna be running around and doing a lot of movements where these can possibly fall out. The nice thing is if they do fall out, then the other one will basically stop working, letting you know it's already fallen out, but it's annoying, these are expensive, and if they do fall, I haven't tested the durability of it, so I'm not sure how durable they are, but if they fall out of your ear, I assume they could possibly get damaged. So um, check this product out in my description. Again, you can pull up, pick it off, uh, pick it off, pick it up from Amazon as a three pack. It does come with a little pouch that you can put, put them in. Um, they're about 10 bucks on Amazon. I will tell you one of the downfalls that I noticed on these is if you have these on the iPods, AirPods, um, again, they kind of just go on like that. You cannot put them in the case, which I believe in my opinion is super annoying because when they're in here, um, they look like this. So there's no way that you can actually close the case itself. It's one extra thing you gotta carry with you. And yes, I, like I said, it has a separate pouch, but it's very annoying to have this separate, put these on every single time you wanna put them in your ear. It's just super annoying. I just, I don't like it. So for some of you, that might not be a, a big deal, but for me, it's a deal breaker. And unfortunately, I will be uh, not using these, but um, I'll still use the, the AirPods at home, uh, but in the gym and running and stuff. I'm not gonna fiddle with these and go back and forth. So that's my take on it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. Let me know what you guys think. If you picked up a pair, if you like it, don't like it, leave it in the comments below. And I will see you on Thursday for Tutorial Thursday. Hope you have a great day. Goodbye.